Welcome back now at 624 and we've been talking this morning about pothole repairs, how they start today in Colorado Springs, but there's another problem that can cause potholes. They were talking about those concrete ramps. They're known as slugs and they're being blamed for some potholes. New size Patrick Nelson shows us why it's a common problem here in the Springs that we all uh, need to think about addressing. <laughs> This time of year, road repair requests are coming in from across Colorado Springs, and I'm learning many of these repairs are needed along the edge of neighborhood streets. Take a look. The experts tell me these slugs or concrete ramps poured in gutters behind homes are widespread. They're not only against code, but they're a reason why many streets are crumbling. We started to get a small hole, and as the years went by, it got bigger and bigger. Renee Garcia has lived in this home near Circle and Galley in Colorado Springs for more than 20 years. He says it's been a struggle to get the attention of the city's road repair crews to take a look at the crumbling road just behind his driveway. Watching the news and seeing you, you know, solving people's problems and helping the people, I said maybe they can help me out. I followed up with Colorado Springs Public Works and a few weeks later, the crumbling road was patched. I'm thrilled. I'm thrilled. I'm so happy that I responded. Road repair crews say what they saw in the roadway near Renee's home is an example of a citywide problem. Cement ramps or slugs poured in the gutters near homes. It will actually stop the water and pool it up, uh, which causes icing issues in the winter or uh, it can actually divert the water out into the roadway, which in this instance uh, is what happened, and uh, it prematurely deteriorates the asphalt in front of their house. In many cases, like Renee's, the slug was in his gutter when he moved in. It's such a common problem, the city is looking for opportunities to remove the slugs when possible, but instead of using portable ramps, some homeowners are pouring cement right back in. There are thousands of them within the city. Seeing the roadway fall apart in the very same way near some of his neighbors' homes, Renee is now encouraging others to speak up too. We pay taxes to have this taken care of. And uh, so people do need to start stepping up and calling and notifying the city that there is a problem. If there's a road repair you would like to report, we posted the resources and ways to do that right now on our website, koaa.com. In Colorado Springs, I'm Patrick Nelson for News 5.